Hey all brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meatshield and welcome back to Torchlight. We are sort of where we left off. I have a confession, I went back and like replayed the whole of the first dungeon. I wasn't happy with my ferret not being named like being named Spot. I had to rename him. So I wiped that file and I started a new one. Renamed him Ferdinand, as you'll be able to see at the top of the screen. Um, but I think everything else is pretty much the same. Other than the fact that I got this Ember Shock skill, which is quite an interesting close combat um, thingamajig. Um, oh, that's the wrong one. I want that. Um, yeah, we've got like some slightly different gear. But other than that, everything is exactly where we left off. We've completed the first dungeon. Go away! We've completed the first dungeon, and we are going on to whatever we have to do next. And i got to remember, I don't have WASD controls. Although that does, I did find out that you can change your weapon set, which is rather handy. So I do have like a melee axe and shield thing going as well. That boy is level 10. He's twice the level I am. That's just not on. Right, where, what am I? Hello. Okay, this guy wants me to go and get him some treasure. Let's do that. Things better not be OP in here. Oh God, things might be OP in here. Jeez. All right. Uh, let's use this new skill of mine. No, come on. Bosh! And yes, I know that with regards to the f my ferret, I know last time I was calling him F Freddy, but when I renamed him, I decided to call him Ferdinand because I just thought it suited him better. It sounded a more, bit more steampunky. And seeing as he's got goggles and he looks like he should be flying a biplane, I thought that was very suitable for him. My pack is full! Oh no! What am I gonna do about that? I guess I'm gonna have to give stuff to Ferdinand. Okay, this thing doesn't seem to make a lot of sense. It's called a fiery quarter staff, but it does ice damage and extra fire damage. I, I think they just make these things up. Really? Oh, I'm sure there's gonna be more stuff around here for me to kill. Yes, of course there is! Goody! Oh, bosh! Ha ha ha! The adventure begins here, I see. Oh god, you're actually taking a bit of a beating. Die, you bastard! Thank you. Now, I'm not, ent I'm not entirely sure what this guy is expecting me to bring back. I mean, for all he knows, there could be absolutely nothing in here. Oh god, that's poisonous. So that's down here. There's loads of poisonous stuff. That's really great. Everything just wants to kill me. Hello, chaps. Bosh. I do like that move. It's very handy. Oh, come on. Yes. Oh, don't you dare block me. This seems to be a rather grisly, gruesome area. Oh, look. Lots of skeletons. Excuse me. Do you, do you mind not shooting me with arrows from the other side of this graveyard? Oh, it's not really a graveyard, is it? It's a crypt. Oh, we found like on another kind of mini boss. I don't know what you call them. I mean, they crop up everywhere, but they're never really particularly difficult to take down. They're kind of a mini boss. But he's dead. I can't carry anymore. Oh, again? Jeez, you need a bigger backpack, mate. Oh, nothing can stop me in this dungeon. You are all weak. Uh, you, Mr. Shambler. Shamble off, will you? Oh, you're the one who poisons the ground. Oh, dear, that was an explosive barrel. Ooh, a Tome of Revelation. That must be the thing the fellow wanted. I'm sure he didn't know it was here. Or what it does. So I'm actually dreading what's going to happen after this. Is this a bad idea? Should I have not done all this? I don't know. There's more goodies. I'll have these. Empty. <laughs> there we go. And we got some fame oh, for doing that. Oh, right. Okay. There's more to do. Another portal? Really? Okay. No, I'm going to leave that for a little while. I'm going to go do favours for other people. Okay, hello. There's a robot that's an aspiring bard. Could be interesting. Battle Varkasir. Okay. Yes, here, here we are. Dudu is totally not... Merlin and or Gandalf. Your fame 
has increased. Oh, goody. I'm glad when that happens. Okay, so now that we've actually opened up Anything you need. things a little more, what do you need? Uh, necropolis buried below the mines, deathlace ember. So you want more ember stuff. Okay. Does anybody else around here want stuff done? Oh, Syl. Frank is dead. My master is lost. I feel responsible for your corruption as well. Somehow the blighted ember is fusing with your flesh, changing it. But at least the progress is slow. Well, that's reassuring. I have some knowledge of the crypts below the mine. The overseer experimented with methods of purifying amber. We may be able to use his knowledge to purge the corruption from you now. Find the overseer's library. His notes should be there. Okay. So, how do I check? These are my quests. Third floor of the mines. The overseer's library. Travel through the portal, and something to do with the necropolis. Right. I have heard of. Yes, I know. I've spoken to you already. Right. So I'm assuming I just need to get back through the mines. Um, you know, something about the third level, which I can't remember. I can't remember how many floors I went through on the last one. So I'm just going to go back through it in case I missed anything. I don't think I did, but one thing I also found out with this is that these maps are randomly generated each time you load. Oh, okay, I still have skull points to load. Um, yes, so if you look closely at this map, or at this layout of the, uh, the mines, as I believe they are referred to, you'll see that they are a different configuration to how they were in episode one which is rather fun. I like it when things, uh, like when the games mix things up a bit, so you never quite get the exact same playthrough. Like playing things like Don't Starve or, um, I don't know, something like Factorio where you get a randomly generated map every single time you do something or other on that. Which, I have an idea in mind for Factorio, and I'm planning on getting back to that game sometime soon. I need to, like, get some money... I've when I should have a little bit of money coming through soon, and I'm going to be getting myself um, like the full copy of the game off Steam um, because I've been watching a load of stuff on YouTube to do with it, and I've got some ideas. I want to see if I can make them work. So I'm not quite sure on how the gameplay is going to work with, or how a Let's Play is going to work with that. Um, this one chap I've been watching has been doing like his playthroughs. He records footage for an hour um, then triple speeds it so it ends up being 20 minutes and then he does um, didn't mean to do that and then he does um, you know kind of post commentary on it um, but I enjoy, I enjoy like doing let's plays like this where I'm, I'm talking over the game as I'm playing it but the thing is with Factorio is it's a fairly slow paced game and it, well, it can be. Um, so that style of um, doing the videos would make a little bit more sense. But I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna see what happens when I eventually get around to doing the doing this concept that I've got in mind. For now, I'm gonna stop blabbering on about this, and I'm gonna punch a barrel that explodes in my face. Well, they really didn't last long there, did they? Good god, we are levelling up really bloody quickly. Level 7 already. Ooh, I think... have we found... thing we were meant to kill? I don't think so. Probably not. Nope, but we've got a load of stuff out of that, which is good. Okay, we're back down on the third floor of the mines, which I think... is where this Vargasir... Um is meant to be, so let's, ooh, okay, let's deal with all these little mobs at the moment, and then we'll figure out, we'll track down this Varkasir thing, are you him? No, you're a mage, 
At least I know that nothing can stand in my way. Oh, that looked like a big creature. Might you have been it? Yes, you are. You're only level three. Oh, <laughs> you do not last long. I have defeated a quest. <laughs> right, now let's get back down to that dank chamber so we can progress further. Oh, it's a big spider. It's a big dead spider. Oh, good lord, there's loads of you buggers around here. Oh, that dank chamber. This hat looks fairly ridiculous. I don't know, I'll take it. Right, back to this big ass Stargate looking thing. Let's get downstairs and get even further into these mines. See what's down here. Tombs of the Awakened. Well, this sounds delightfully ominous, and there's spiders crawling out the drains! Oh, good god! Ugh, punch them! So we got lots of undead down here. Let's see the things have taken a turn for the worse. Now, which way is going to be best? Let's have a look through here. Some golden stuff lying around. Uh, seems to be fairly dead endish. So let's just kill things. Oh, I found a spell scroll. Lovely. Okay, so that was not the way we wanted to be going. This is. Well, of course, there's a bridge leading to some sort of end point. No, oh, no, oh, poison, poison. Why are you standing around in the poison? Not how you go about dealing with these things. Right, I'm gonna stay away from this thing once he farts out all of his poison. Ferdinand, get back here! You're only gonna do yourself harm. I don't really need that shrine of mana until I presumably run out of mana. Considering the amount of mana potions I have, that's not really gonna be happening anytime soon. So I think I can just feel free to keep wandering around and punching the crap out of any undead little bastards that wander up and try to eat my face. Like so! Oh, I've got mana to last me for days, mate. You ain't ever gonna get past me. Ah, oh, bloody mimic chests! God, the amount of gold those things fart out when they're done. Glorious. My pack is full. Your pack is full again, is it? Well, I best we guess we'd better go sorting through it. Oh, okay. What is this? End of the line? Oh no, there's a lever. One that I can actually interact with. Nice! Oh Jesus Christ, what the hell was that thing? Some sort of trap, I'm assuming. I don't know, the audio tried to say something, but I couldn't hear it over everything exploding around me. What is this? Another lever. Lever. I don't know. Something beginning with Ooh, hello. What are you? Oh jeez! Bloody mimics! Oh, okay. Let's go in. Let's see what's here. Could be interesting. Lost chamber. Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh Get them all together, get them all together, and then... Punch them! Ah! Oh, I love this move so much. It's amazing. I fucking... You can all die. Again. Oh, God, I am wounded. Jeez. That got a bit hairy, didn't it? But will you just drop dead? Even though you're un undead. Your pack is always full. Have you ever thought about getting a bigger backpack? Oh, God, get away, get away quickly. Bottleneck them on the bridge, bottleneck them on the bridge. Come on. Oh, God, these guys are all level eight. No wonder they're giving me a bit more of a challenge. I'm used to fighting stuff that's half my strength. Well, everything's trying to kill me and I don't like it. No! Yeah. Bosh! Bosh, I say! Come on, Ferdinand, let's get him! 
Oh, God, he is a tough son of a bitch, isn't he? Oh, and he's not tough enough. No. Dealt with. You have Whoa, you... Fuckers. Oh, God. Bloody hell, where the hell did this lot come from? I mean, I did see, don't worry, I'm not that stupid. But... Let's try and deal with them in a timely fashion. Thank you. Is that everything dealt with? Another lever here. Oh, okay. <sighs> I think we're going to be here a while. Alright, let's get in and... Punch! That's a lot of gold. Oh, and there's a portal out of here as well. Wonderful! Okay, right, that takes us right back here. Okay. But, uh, hmm. Let me get in here. Ooh, okay. Maybe shouldn't have come in here. Nice to have everything back to a level that I feel capable of beating the crap out of, seeing as I'm twice as strong. But, I think I'm going to leave things here. Been recording for, I was getting on for an hour. It's about three quarters of an hour at the moment. So I think I'm just going to check the map, see how I'm doing. Can't really see where I'm meant to be going. But, hey, it's an adventure. What do you expect? Oh, cool. It shows us in what part of the map we are in as well. So that's pretty cool. Nice to see us in the Necropolis now, whatever the bloody hell that place is called. But yes, I'm going to leave this episode off here. Hope you're enjoying this series. Um, I'm, it's going to be going on for a little while, I should reckon, because I'm having good fun with it. And, I mean, come on, there's a ferret with goggles. Who's not going to enjoy a series that's got that? But I will leave this episode off here and just say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed it and you want to see more Let's Plays or Metal Covers from me, you can check out the playlists that are on the channel. And you can follow the links in the description below to find me on social medias. But for now, thank you again for watching this video and I will catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meat Shield, signing off. to me in cold blood don't make me feel bad because i'm trying to survive a winter that you have imposed upon me against my will hello penguin